I would like to say that I'm very, very thankful for each one of you for attending uh, the launch of Sweet Poison tonight. Um, basically, I would like to start to talk a bit about how this collection of poems came into being. So essentially, um, I wrote this book back in 2020 um, in a fortnight. Um, there are 18 poems, so you know, as you can probably guess, some nights have been busier than others and I didn't get much sleep. Um, prior to writing the book, I had for quite some time been really submerged by um, emotions which took on the form of images and these images had become quite fixated in my mind. One day, um, I started to uh, translate these images um, and accompany these images with words and it all started flowing from there in a continuous outpouring. So this is actually why it was so important for me to illustrate the poems as well, to really try and capture all of the emotions in their entirety. This collection could therefore not have seen the light um, without this fusion of images, words, and the internal music of the verses. As you can probably tell from this, I didn't really make a conscious decision to write. I was merely trying to find a way to free myself from this flow of contradictory passions which were tearing me apart. For context, um, I was at the time going through the breakdown of a profound and long-lasting relationship, which explains the intensity of the feelings and of the, the, all of the questions overpowering my mind. And that the only way to liberate myself from these feelings was to let them have their own separate existence and kind of have their own life. This entire process has, has had a real cathartic effect upon me and has helped me to reassemble the elements of my inner self. It provided the way for liberation and it has allowed me to move forward with new aspirations and new energy. Now, you may wonder why I chose to publish such a deeply personal experience. Um, it is because what I have lived through is not unique and it is part of the universal human experience. And therefore, I believe that the poems can resonate with others and that they can hold meaning for them as well. So, Yes, yeah, so that was about the book. Um, we have a little surprise entertainment for you tonight. But before I give the mic to Daniela, I would like to thank a few people from the bottom of my heart. Thank you to my family, with a special thanks to my dad, without whose unwavering support and occasionally authority, <laughs> I, <w> <laughs> I, I, I wouldn't have gathered the strength to um, illustrate the poems and to go ahead and publish. Thank you to Sadna for all of her efforts in making this happen and to my mom for her moral support. Thank you to Mrs. Shakuntala Hawaldar um, for her lovely preface and her words of wisdom. Thank you to Mr. Vijay Patti for doing the design and for his patience with my numerous changes. And a special thank you to Daniela for making one of my other dreams come true in a few minutes and opening up my throat chakra. On this note, I now pass on the mic to Daniela. Kanjali m'a demandé de l'accompagner sur un texte. Je lui ai dit, mais ton recueil est en anglais. Je ne suis pas en anglais. Il <rire> m'a dit, mais je veux que ce soit toi qui m'accompagne. J'ai dit, OK. Deuxième chose, je ne joue pas la guitare en public. Elle me dit, mais en fait, j'aurais bien aimé que tu m'accompagnes à la guitare. Anjali, je la connais depuis qu'elle est toute petite. Et puis ça me faisait tellement plaisir quand j'ai commencé à lire son recueil. Ça m'a parlé, ça a bougé des choses en moi. Et je me suis dit, toi Anjali, let's go. Donc aujourd'hui, c'est un 
cet espace inédit et euh, j'ai l'immense honneur de passer le micro à Jani et on va vous chanter un texte qui s'appelle The Start. On a tous vécu, tous et toutes vécu des relations où on ne pouvait pas se détacher de l'autre, même si c'était toxique. Et dans ces, comme on dit en, en, en créole réunionnais, la maillage, c'est en mêlée. Les sentiments sont emmêlés et en fait, de manière très simple, Anjali a pu, dans ce, dans ce texte qui s'appelle The Start, expliquer dans ces mots ces relations troublantes. On passe au grand Endless blows and vicious fights. Endless blows and vicious fights. But I always come back. I always come back to you. Flood of tears and crinkling fear. Flood of tears and crinkling fear. But I always come back to the star. In this 
roller coaster. I followed you twisting your turns. I run and I stumble. I would faint and I would burn. I would faint and I would burn. But outside me, I could not survive. Cause you were my only, cause you were the light. When you left me, I was two and eight. When you left me, I was two and eight. Have we come full circle? Can I take another ride? Can I? My infinity has come to an end. Date, fate, hate. Is this what it comes down to? I would do anything to run another cycle with you. When I met you, I was one and eight. I remember it like it was only yesterday. Have we come full circle? Can I take another ride with you? My infinity has come to an end. Date, fate, hate. Is this what it comes down to? I would do anything to run another cycle with you. When I met you, I was one and eight. When you left me, I was two and eight.